This is a sanctuary by Matt Braham. And I actually met Matt in like a, a the Christian game development conference and uh, Ohio meetup, local meetup. So this is his game. And it was described to me like a Five Nights at Freddy's at, at a church. <laughs> and I've, I've, I've seen the, uh, it been played, but I'm gonna play it here. By my, uh, I didn't try it on the demo, so it'll be interesting. Um, I mean, I've already been spoiled. So, there are the achievements here. So I've already seen this, or well, some of them. At the demo, but now we've already seen the gameplay too. But it should be easy. I mean, it look it look kind of easy. It's basically a quiz game. So, anyways, yeah, let's get into this. So apparently, you're like down your luck. Well, this. Uh, the drivers are gonna come up because they've been spoiled, but... Just entrance? Okay, I can get us. First night. Anything? No. It looks creepy. <laughs> That's not very trustworthy. It looks very Austinian, definitely. Joel Osteen inspired. <laughs> wait, 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 Austin wrote novels? I mean, if I was just there, I'd just sleep here. <laughs> I could double walk. Oh, let's go to the sanctuary. This. What does praying do? Like sunset though. Yeah. Does it remind me of many churches I have? I thought nursery locked. That's kind of creepy. Kids are not locked. Yeah, why is the curtain now? Primary room. What? It's the same thing. <laughs> Where's the Bible? You might have to send it into overtake. I mean, does that is that how faith really works? <laughs> I mean, I know it's a useful game mechanic, but I'm also I'm also a game designer and a Christian, so I'm actually I actually have a game I'm working on that's about faith. Like, the Bible actually says about faith, but time not time for the shameless plug. So let's do this. 
may mga pass me the thing about this is it assumes you're already a Christian uh, I have okay can we break okay interesting They are helping me. Alright, it has easy so far. Okay. It will not be stored a little for every successful thing I know. Okay, that's good. No fear in the nothing. I'm dumb. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Do not have the best kids room. Right. Okay. Before I do that one, just make sure. Okay, so it's it's only limited. So it is. Casting all your faith upon it for. The character designs are something very reminiscent of 90s games. Definitely a pink. Very uh, Undertale, like the, the music and like <laughs> the UI, kinda. It just it has a vibe. Mm -hmm. It's not just a quiz game, it's just a lot of, like, it's very, um, so there's stuff like that which is cool. Mm -hmm. but yeah, I, I mean, usually I don't like Bible quiz games because it can be cheesy. I mean, this is, oh, it's also a bit cheesy, but. <laughs> The gimmicks, yes. Hmm. This is some novelty.
Where? Now block projectors and all factory effects. Okay. I like. Eat something. Oh, your heart bubbled. Yes. It's like, you know, like Undertale it has a bullet bullet hell thing. Oh, well, it does have a quiz for that, which is cool. Oh, here's. Mm -hmm. James words. Should be well, maybe. I don't know, maybe I need to get like the Bible. <laughs> but he's like gangster <laughs> or like
Okay. James Mujin, amen. Okay, and ironically. Robots quick pass on each other. I saw something, I think. I'll just review the footage after, but. Why would he have a... Actually, my phone is a trouble found it in the crops. Three left. I mean, we're not left. Where is it? Actually, my phone is in there. It's like an anonymous hacker. Thank <laughs> you. 
worker smart. <laughs> so I've been, I've seen this, and he said it's a typo. I don't expect someone with that face to make that typo for grammar mistake. I would like to see what the day looks like. All we see is the bus drive. It's probably the story is that you're down your luck, so use the bus to go to work. So yeah, I wanna see if like this is seen. But you know whatever. I mean, the singes are more Dangerous. <laughs> so one hit, one kill.
Oh, okay. Kids section. Yeah, the annoying. 